students this is your director sunita juneja addressing you being a teacher at the core of my heart i felt like connecting with you through an audio and picked up a poem my mother at 66 to explain through my audio lecture as i was interacting with your english teacher he has already given you the contents videos as well as written content but i felt my audio should also be attached as a supplement to your already existing resources the first poem which i have picked up is my mother at 66 as you know kamla das a very sensitive writer from kerala she has penned down this poem and when she is driving from her parents home the poetess is very emotional when she looks at her mother's colorless pale weak open mouth and she is quietly dozing off on her seat to the writer to the poet to the poetess she appears like a corpse meaning a dead body and that persistent pain ache which she had been nurturing rather she was feeling in her heart for a long time because of the insecurity of losing her mother because she had grown old she had already stepped into her evening phase of life that troubled her internally she became very she became very emotional and disturbed thinking that when she would visit her parents house again probably her mother would not be alive in order to shun those sad thoughts she looks out of the window she to change her mindset she looks at the trees she looks at the trees as you know in a moving car trees seems to be running sprint mean running so as she looked out through the window she saw the trees a symbol of life running away and happy merry happy children getting scattered in groups spilling like you spill the beans so similarly the young children get spilled out of their homes in groups for play and they are a symbol of happy life for her so here is a contrast between her mother's weakness paleness her her old age and the young children who who spills out of their homes after she had cleared her security check which is a which is a custom at the airport after she cleared her security check and she was standing at a distance from her mother getting a vintage view from the vintage view she again looked at her mother and she was enveloped by those serious and sad thoughts once again again she observed that colorless pale face of her mother which she has compared as a simile with the late winter's moon and that same old pain the same old agony of separation enveloped her that childhood fear which she had been persistently feeling right from her childhood again enveloped her thoughts again she shunned those thoughts and shunning those thoughts away she said 
गुड बाय टू हर मदर एंड ए प्लास्टिक आर्टिफिशियल स्माइल शी अडोर्ड ऑन हर लिप्स एंड शी स्माइल्ड स्माइल्ड एंड स्माइल दिस इज द रियालिटी ऑफ लाइफ वन हु हैज कम टू दिस वर्ल्ड हैज टू लीव दिस वर्ल्ड एंड इट इज वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर द डियर वंस टू से गुड बाय सो द सेम फीलिंग विच द पोइट इज वॉज फीलिंग एवरी वन फील्स एंड दिस इज द रियालिटी ऑफ लाइफ